the multi temp unit i'm going to show you guys how to set the temp on the different zones and turn on and off the different zones so first we have the switch right here it's in off and we want to flip it up to start run so we flip the switch on now we're going to wait for it to go and turn on and run through its little diagnostic make sure everything is up and running so it's starting to turn on as you can see the carrier logo is coming on You see the alarm light flashing, that's okay. When you turn on the unit, it's just supposed to happen because it's running through diagnostics, making sure everything's going. And as you can see on the screen, a little sign that says, standby progress, transition in progress in 20 seconds. So we're gonna wait till that goes through and uh, wait for it to turn on. So we heard the beep and, and as you can hear, the unit turned on. So now we're gonna focus on the zones. So you can see C1, C2, and C3. On C1 at the very top, you see the 44. That's the temperature currently inside the trailer. And then if underneath it, you'll see the negative 20. That's the set point, as you can see, set point's right next to it. And then you can see what just appeared is cool. That means the unit is now cooling. So what we want to do is we want to turn on zone two and three. To do that, we're going to hit the menu button. And you can see it shows C1, C2, and C3. C1's on, C2, and C3 are off. Now to turn them on, we're going to hit the soft key. And as you can see, they flip to on, and on is now highlighted. So what we're going to do, we're going to wait a couple minutes for the, and it, after a couple minutes, it should Go back to the main menu and show that C1 and C2, or C2 and C3, excuse me, are on. So now you can see zone two and zone three are both on. In zone two, you have 48 degrees, and the set point is 10. In zone three, you have 57 degrees, and the set point is 35. Once again, the 48 and the 57 are the temperatures in those respective zones, and 10 and 35 is the set point. Now to change the temperatures in the individual zones, as you can see, the boxes are being highlighted individually and it's cycling through them. So what we're gonna do is to set the tip in zone one, we're gonna wait. Now zone one is highlighted, we're gonna hit the arrow key. Oh, hang on, that was zone two. So we're gonna wait for zone one to be highlighted. And once zone one's highlighted, we're gonna hit the arrow key and we can change the different the temperature. Now to set the temperature, we're gonna go to negative, I'm gonna set back to negative 20, we're gonna hit the equal sign. And as you can see, the set point is now negative 20 again. So to set the temperature in zone two, we're gonna wait for the zone two box to be highlighted. And then hit the arrow key, and we can now change the temperature. I'm gonna set it back to 10, and to do that, I'm gonna hit equals. Same thing for zone three, wait for it to be highlighted, hit the arrow keys to change the temperature and hit equal to set it. Now, another thing is if you change the temperature since we're in zone one and then I don't hit equals and I let it go, it'll start flashing and then the whole screen will start flashing and like you see the alarm went off. That just shows that we did not set the temperature and after it's done flashing, it'll show that the temperature is negative 20 and it'll go because we didn't set it so it went back to its original temp. Now to change or to shut down the, the zones, you'll hit menu. And then once again, we're in this screen, we'll hit the off soft key for zone two and zone three, because that's the ones I want to turn off. And now they'll show off and they're both highlighted. So we'll wait for those commands to go through. And now, 
both of those zones are off. Another thing up here, which is really interesting, is at the very top, you see what looks like a box that represents the trailer, and in each box in the different zone is colored in. Those colored in boxes represent the zone in the trailer. So zone one is up towards the front, zone two is in the middle, and zone three is back near the doors. Now, if you have any further questions, please call us at 866-225-7623, extension 4. Thank you.